I'm Lenzi Nikishik, uh, and I'm the co-designer of Umisu. And I'm Pinar Yigin, and I'm the co-designer. I studied fashion design and in art school. Once I went there, I was lucky, I went to Pratt in New York, and I really liked my, my teachers and, you know, how they left us very uh, free. So, since the very beginning, I always drew kind of uh, in a naive, um, more childish way that I enjoyed. But I have to say, I was I first got into drawing because of my older sister, <laughs> like every younger, you know, sibling does. I also love um, illustrating by hand. I didn't study it, but it was always um, something that I did. Well, we we try to basically try not to take life too seriously when we design and so each one uh, is an independent story. For example, you said the alien wedding. That yeah. should explain that one. <laughs> I mean, basically we play and whatever comes while we're uh, playing. Mm -hmm. like, exactly, the alien wedding, some friend of mine was um, joking that you know, if I ever got married it wouldn't be like a, to a normal human, it would be someone from, the, from an alien. So from that joke I like, came about um, the whole idea of my wedding and me inviting my husband's uh, alien husband's friends to that wedding and them uh, dancing the traditional Turkish dance <laughs> at that wedding. You just have to turn it into an interesting print that anyone else could relate to, and, you know, without knowing the story. But we try to share some of the story on the tags because of that reason, because we know we would, would like the final customer to understand why we're into these things. Because at the end of the day, yes, they show themselves the best when you open them up, but they are to be warm, so you have to think about that as well. One of the most important things about Rumisu, the crochet, hand crochet, uh, amigurumi pieces, um, Pinar makes the very first ones because we work with these ladies in southeastern Turkey as a part of a social responsibility project supported by UNDP. We buy our silk uh, also in Turkey. There's a town that's you know traditionally has always been since the Ottoman times producing silk. We buy from that town from another family business and then print the the, the printing in Istanbul and then we join it all over here and. Um, do our shipping and handling lovingly together over here. So, yeah, everything is made in Turkey. <laughs>